Final School and welcome to your daily notices for Friday the 28th of November. It has been rumoured that our two favourite news presenters have run away from news reading. If anyone has seen Colin or Daniela, please let Mr Mulholland know immediately. Immediately, He will give out a whole packet of chocolate fish to anyone providing a tip of as to the whereabouts of these missing people. Today, rooms 10 and 2 are off to the beach. If you can please wave at goodbye as you see them leave our school, they shall be back around 2.45 while they are at Mairangi Bay. They will be learning about beach safe, being safe at the beach and they will also be catching some snapper. Sounds a bit fishy to me. And now for the latest gossip from Pine Hill School. It has been rumoured that a staff member who will remain nameless auditioned in disguise for Pine Hill's Got Talent. Fortunately, Mr. Sir's attempt to make it in onto the show was discovered in time and was told off by the audition panel, whereupon he was heard to say this, show's got no principles, to which one of the judges replied, in principles, we agreed with you, but you still don't look very good in those tights. Come back in uniforms. I am still waiting for two boys' uniforms and six girls' uniforms. If you have not yet handed your kapahaka uniforms in, please, do so ASAP. Tigers Touch Team, you have a training today. Meet Miss Ramaka outside room 16 during lunchtime eating and take your lunches. Ukulele group. Please return your permission slip to Mrs. Joel in room twelve. <coughs> if you don't need to borrow it, <coughs> if you don't need to borrow a ukulele for Saturday, come to the rhythm room at twelve forty and see Mrs. Blanchard or Mrs. Joel. Remember, you must bring back your permission slip to get a T-shirt. The Walking School Bus Program are holding an end of year movie event in Hoyts, in Wild Eye Park, on Sunday, 7th December at 2pm. They have hired a cinema, which means they have some extra seats to sell. The movie will be in advanced screening of Penguins of Madagascar. These tickets are available for $10 each, adults and children. The ladies involved will be selling them between the school office and hall this afternoon and tomorrow afternoon after school. Be in quick. There are only 30 seats left. Mrs. Barrett has a winner. The first class to get all their books back is... Room 2! Well done. Mrs. Barrett will be along to see you sometime today with your treat. Year 5 TV presenters, check Room 9's window to see when you're on next week. Room 5 will now share some of their learning.
words with you. Good morning, everybody. I've had a bit of a change of appearance this morning. As you can see, I've been shrunk and I've been made to a little puppet. And I don't really like it very much, I'd have to say. In fact, I really can't stand it. But, anyway, what is what? Just have to put up with it. Well, first of all today, this squeaky voice is really driving me crazy. But anyway, first of all today, I'd like to wish the glasses who are going to beach Ed all the best because it's raining. Ha <laughs> You're going to get wet. But you're going to have good fun, I think. And uh, that's how, in fact, that I shrank because I went swimming yesterday and my clothes got tighter and tighter and tighter and suddenly I turned into a little uppity person like this one here. Anyway, to the rest of you, have a fantastic day today. Look after everybody and I'll see you next week. Daily notices for Friday the 28th of November. Remember, if you missed any of these notices, they will be available all day on the Pirate Hill TV station wiki page. Thank you for watching. Have a Pine Hill day using the Pine Hill way.